more intense. We get Alvin's support. Uh, Alvin Archer's arrived to guide us through Mirkwood. I, I love this unit too that they give us. Love to see Battle for Middle Earth 2 assets worked into DAC. Absolutely. Yeah, his his voice lines absolutely fit in. All right, setup. We want to go for the high ground. It looks like there's high ground there, and there's also high ground to take here, which might do us better to kind of more so corner up. But will this give us actually a better firing position if we line up down here? Yeah, let's do that. So we can fight like this. It's the problem fighting like that is that Balin is kind of facing forward. But hey, we'll have fun. This is going to be a good battle. So big thing is we have to protect the Alvin archers. We have to kind of stick them in the middle. Uh, you guys do not fire well. I don't think I had him on fire well, which is fine. You know what? With the amount of troops we're fighting, we might as well put these guys back a notch too. Just want to make sure that they have a good firing position, so they will have to move up a bit to actually get that. See, I just don't like that they say my axe grows restless when it's a hammer unit. <laughs> Granted, Ballin has an axe, so maybe it's him talking. Uh, do not fire at will, but guard mode so you don't chase after thing. Anything. These guys should get a lot of kills. They're very good archers. Ah, right in front of us. Oh, and they have catapults! Nice! Okay. That changes things. We're gonna have to march on the catapults. Let's group these guys up. And then we'll group these guys up. So we can maneuver. We can maneuver to the right. What do they have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten units total. We have. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 units total too. So we can just 10v10 them. Just make sure each unit grabs one unit. But ideally, we probably want to maneuver the archers around behind them. So we'll, we'll maybe give them the hill to start. I'm going to maneuver to the right flank. We're obviously going to speed this up because it's going to take some sweet, sweet time to get our army over here. But they will advance on us, which is great. Balin has a uh, leadership attribute that will allow her him to... Okay, they are going for the shot, so let's actually back up. I'm going to have you guys back right up. gather his uh to gather like his stamina back up yo what i miss <laughs> show me ballin cross good to see you man welcome to the stream i'll show you ballin you've been a long time sub there's ballin 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 he's got the crown he's got the mithril armor it's got Duran's axe attached to his axe. I basically, the concept for this is that he forges Duran's axe with his own because in his retinue he eventually gets both. You got the blue wizards here and Glorfindel there. And look at this massive, beautiful unit. Awesome. Fighting catapults right now, so we gotta use some sly tactics to actually get them. For some reason, their catapults move fast. <laughs> I think it's because they're moving downhill. They're going to slow up big time once they uh, get to the front of the hill. Our guys are warmed up. Let's spread out. What is this? 
That's army one. You guys now have gotten enough space to cut. Over. And then we'll fight the bulk of their army with the reclaimers. Zoom in map. This is going to be a little bit of uh, chess. Now do I rush them? Because their whole army is going to get in front of that. I might be better off to rush them to set up a pillar, but they're going to take fire from the catapult, so I'm going to shift out back again. Go like that, just to throw them off. They're going to suck if they have to throw their shot. Good. They're not keeping up with me. Normally they would either split their army or their entire army would go for one attack. It looks like their catapults are going for these guys, which that might be an opening right there. Let's let's go up and over, because they're not going to have a... Oh, it just broke formation. Not cool. Oh, it's because I have balance selected. That's stupid. Why is balance selected? <laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, man. Okay, let's do that. Make sure balance good to go. You guys. Can we get these guys back into formation? Probably not. Oh, yes, we can! See, that's a perfect spot. They're going to have a hard time hitting anything with their catapults in that angle. Yeah. Did they get any kills? I don't think so. Okay, they're breaking some units off. Yeah, that's our opening. Okay. Drop the drop the group. Okay, you boys, you're going right for them because you're going to be the fast boys. Everybody else, you're the pillar. So position there. And then you guys are in, obviously. Sorry about the pausing, guys. Old habit. We are working them, though. Their catapults are so confused on what to do, which is a beautiful thing to see. You'll love to see it. <laughs> Memento, good to see you, man. Got to put those crossbows to work. Absolutely do. Absolutely do. Thanks for the strats. Let's get in a position to actually put them to work. Is this going to be a good firing position? Yeah, potentially. We should probably pillar him though first. Let's rush him. Okay, now... What's going on here? Oh, did they not get the order? There we go. Okay, that's the first shot. That might be a good shot, but it looks like it's hitting the hill. That one might hit somebody. No, nope, it's over the top. Stop and shoot. And you guys can stop and shoot something deep. You guys set up and just wait. And you're winded. Should we draw the Balin? You're faster, elves. Go over and then go over like that. Good throw. Start going after the elves. Crossbows are going to work. That's a good target. Okay, you guys got to keep going. Keep going, keep going. This is such a tight race. I don't know if we're going to get it. I think we're going to get it. We're at least going to stop them for the time being. 
Beautiful. In line, archers. Fight it out, archers. There we go. Okay, they're gonna be pinned down for a bit. Okay, 126 and winded. We're almost in position with the rest of the army. We're gonna go right for our buddies. Let's put this platoon style to work. You guys hide in. You guys hide in too, actually. Hide in. It's like they're going right for my missile units. Look at that. Oh my gosh. We need to stop them. <laughs> That's exactly what that was. Alright, you guys can fight. That's fine. You guys over, and then you guys over. Run at Adam. Just to get him a little bit of help. And then tighten up. And then you guys fight that. We're gonna use shield wall pretty heavily. You're tired, okay, it's time to pop. Pop that guy. Let's look at these guys, they are surrounded. It's okay, Balance coming. Run right across their line, boys. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. And then. You guys are the guard for them. They're gonna be fresh and we can move shield walls now. Push them. Good job. Okay, Valen's in the heat. Spread out the line. Yeah, boys. Yeah. That's kind of hurt. How's my shield wall doing? Ready for push? No, not that kind of push, but that kind of push. There we go. Good job. You guys can stop shooting. Shoot that instead. Shoot that instead. Run at him. Terrible charge from a 30 back. <laughs> Archers are holding very well. We can shield wall push with Balin now. Let's take their heaviest units out first. There he is. Okay, now archers. Let's drop the group. That's their heaviest unit. What do we shoot at right now? Probably nothing. Let's get these guys working. Help kill them. The enemy are badly bloodied. They you guys move out there. Okay, how are we looking up here? Shield wall push again. My axe grows restless. Blue Wizards. There's the Ballin in the back. Get him, Ballin. Get him, Ballin. The 
Looks like he's just trying to be the leader right now. Go for it. Okay, we got a guy ready to shoot. They just literally push through them with a the shield wall. That's insane. Good job fighting in the back. Lost a couple missiles, that's fine. Hold your ground, boys, that's right. Big push coming from Ballin right now. <laughs> oh, dwarves, I missed you. Look at the push. here. How are we looking over here? Okay, shoot him. You guys stop and shoot. Oh, no. They want to keep fighting. He's down. I'm super happy that we didn't take any catapult deaths. Look at that, they're like running out. It's not a route, it's a avoiding the shield wall push, basically. Good boys. Help your missile units get the hell out of there. I could shoot the sub. Oh, Balin's just done. <laughs> oh gosh, Balin is just done. I love it. Get going, Balin. Up the hill. Got archers ready. You guys can help over here. Surround them. You guys start fighting too. Go for it. I'm a Big push. Keep marching. You basically took them out. March for them. Balance coming. It's going to take him some time though. He's slow. Call hacks. <laughs> sort of. So it's it's called the Platts and Bats mod, so there's going to be units that are super small. So you see like the 30 size units, and then there's going to be units that are big, like uh, Balance Guard and like Reclaimers. Keep marching, boys. What is going on over here? It looks like they just finished. Keep going up the hill, boys. Come on up. Pound's up the hill. Okay, Vaughn, get them some backup. Wow, they just steamrolled them. Okay, let's make sure that we get the attack on them. If there's any left. You're done. Okay, they got stopped by something, so let's just march right through them. Glorfindel. Man, Glorfindel really sticks out because he's so tall and his sword is huge. Oh, good grief. These guys are ready, too. Go for it. 
surround him. Man, they're getting sandwiched right now. Here comes the push. Nice, that's over. Good fight. Captain Stacks will actually be hard to deal with. Thankfully, the dwarves kill very effectively. <laughs> 94 a loss, 2,000 killed. Golden Sword is going to go to Balin for sure. 800. Oh, good grief.